Lithium prices staged a sharp, sentiment-driven rebound this week after China's battery giant, CATL, halted production at its Zhenjiao mine in Yichun, Jiangxi, when the site's mining license expired on August 9. The most active lithium carbonate contract in Guangzhou immediately hit its 8% daily limit, and lithium producers from Shanghai to the ASX ripped higher. CATL says it's seeking a renewal as soon as possible. CATL's Yichun project, rated at just over 46,000 T LCE per year, amounts to roughly 3% of forecast 2025 global supply. News of the suspension flipped futures limit up and sparked double-digit games in names such as Pilbara Minerals, Liontown, IGO, Core Lithium, and Mineral Resources. Even after the bounce, the market is climbing out of a deep hole. Benchmark lithium prices have fallen 90% from 2022 peaks amid China lithium overcapacity and softer EV demand. Beijing's recent rhetoric against overcapacity and permit scrutiny has fed a rebalancing narrative, helping futures, if not yet resetting fundamentals. Likely beneficiaries now low-cost hard rock producers, spodumene, and ASX lithium names that were heavily shorted and cash flow constrained. Any price relief helps. Under pressure, high-cost converters and refineries, loss-making hydroxide projects face tighter margins unless prices hold above recent levels. Australia-focused coverage notes spodumene has rebounded toward $880 per ton from mid-June lows near $610 per ton still a fraction of 2022 levels. Three catalysts could turn a head fake into a trend. China supply discipline, permit enforcement, capacity curbs, slower restarts at care and maintenance assets, consolidation, M&A that removes marginal tons, policy nudges that temper overproduction. Recent actions suggest authorities are willing to rein in excess capacity, at least at the margin, supporting the rebalancing story. Three events that could kill it. A quick CATL restart once the license is renewed. Inventory overhang working back into spot. EV demand softness that keeps the market in surplus. Analysts estimate the outage could erode a 60,000-ton 2025 surplus, but warn a broader surplus re-emerges without further discipline. The long view? Prices remain far below 2022's records, underscoring how much China lithium overcapacity still hangs over the market.